guys how's it going Phil Montelioni the book peddler coming to you with another YouTube video this one's gonna be on a tour of my new bookstores so I've completely reinvented the main shop redid it I've, I've uh, organized and redone the secondary location and I have the big grand opening June 1st 10 to 7 p.m. the time went very fast and uh, I can't believe it's a couple days away so I would like to give you guys a first sneak peek into my new buildings I'll give you the grand tour, okay, the best I can, and explain the setup and, and everything like that and the vision going forward, basically. Now, if you have it, I'm doing a, uh, uh, a giveaway for my YouTube subscribers. I'm going to choose three winners. <laughs> the, in the description, the first link is the video to uh, sign up for the giveaway. Everything's free. Um, I asked like eight questions. I won't do that again. I know I guess people don't like asking, uh, answering all these questions and emailing to me. But I appreciate those who have participated in it. I would love it if there's even more participation. So click that link and you have until the first to send it in. And you'll win shirts, mugs, uh, $50 gift uh, certificates and stuff like that. So go check that out. Guys, let's check out the shop. Quick, real quick. Um, I appreciate all your support out there. I couldn't have done any of this without friends and family, um, of course, first and foremost. And your guys' support really encourages me and motivates me to keep making these videos. I'm not really a, uh, into all this stuff all the time, but you guys enjoy it. And um, so I do the best I can. And throughout all the years, thank you so much for, for your support. So here's the back of my building. It's a little windy, but everything's been stained. I got in flower beds. I have a patio now. <laughs> Shout out to Bruce Drake for the help on all this. And yeah, I'll clear everything out, of course, but uh, it's looking a lot nicer. I'll walk you up to the front. A lot of shadow today. Boarded these up. Everything's matching. Let me take you up here. And here's the front of the shop right there. We got some peaks up there. I'm going to put a light in the middle. We metaled the roof. Got the flag hanging. I'm going to put the open flag on this side. Check out the flower gardens, how beautiful they look. So this front presentation, and there's the new sign up. This presentation is beautiful, I think. Put up this sign here, hanging one. This sign came from Steve, Brick House Salvage and Antiques, painted, repainted the black, and I got this pole on a pick. <laughs> Alright, let's take you inside, guys. And here we go. <laughs> so this is to the right. This is what, what greets you right away. I'm going to back out. And from there, and all the way around, it's all New York. When you turn to the right here, there's a little sitting area. And some window, you know, decoration, whatever. Getting the walls done. Excuse the lighting. And, yeah, here's a stacker. Kind of miscellaneous, this stuff. But you see how I'm kind of setting it up? I like the presentation here. I'll back away. So, yeah, very, very, uh, very cozy place. Here you can sit and look at books. This is uh, some of my favorite New York material that I've ever had in so that's nice and then uh, okay I'll take you to the right first so you can come around here actually I'll take you down the middle so this is all everything New York all general New York right here filled up this is all New York New York ephemera in the box and then uh, oh let me turn around there's another case that's all local masonic then i have some great sets like man myth and magic encyclopedia freemasonry and then over here so here's a nice case and i think i showed you in a previous video what i'm doing is like marrying items together so i have a first edition league of the iroquois by morgan and next to it is the eastern woodlands iroquois club not the uh not the um popular ones that came later but that's an earlier one now, before I get to the back, let's go up to the front. Up here to the left, this is all hunting, fishing, firearms from this case around. And uh, I got these carpets, this runner, and this carpet from Him and Haw and Green. 
and here's papers for the giveaway that we're doing in the shop but yeah this is all better better fishing book material and whatnot just load it up it's wonderful and then this print kind of caps it off this is where my coffee stand will be right here i'm not doing it for the day because i don't want food and drinks in here i'm putting a water tank right there and i'm getting my coffee this is all funded by you guys as subscribers from buy me a coffee uh fund and i'm getting it all from great minds coffee roaster a company out of connecticut that my friends run and i've already drank three bags of it so i gotta load up some more so okay let's continue the tour this double-sided shelf i left in the whole thing about this is these are all going to be on this side wow that lighting's crazy new non-fiction book picks and the reverse is going to be fiction so when i go on a book pick my in-shop customers get first pick or i mean first the first ability to buy books before they hit the internet now all these are online currently because i haven't been picking lately but i got to fill up this obviously but that's what i'm going to offer my shop customers back here are collectible miscellaneous books this will always be in flux got some wonderful titles and what i did was i put these uh cards here i think it just looks good presentation wise um to talk about what the book is and everything so yeah, I'm I'm really happy with 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 this section. It looks really good. So you keep coming. Got some caribou horns I got to hang. This is uh, you know, children's books, nice illustrated material, art right there, the better art stuff. Now let's go here. Of course, we got the cabinet of controversy. And uh so you'll see how that's being low up. Right now a lot of Black Americana stuff, Black Panther um so that's good so yeah this is the front here here's this uh new case position i'm gonna have a runner in front of that as well uh cash check only plus extortion tax all right there's my t-shirts up there and i have them packed away in here in coffee mugs and uh here's the back here's to the left so what do you think of that guys huh i love me personally i love it yeah, some folk art. Here you have, that's a 1700s trade axe. Some stone heads there. Really, really cool stuff. So yeah, it's coming along pretty well. That's the main shop here, and I'm going to take you to the secondary shop. What I did, obviously, for those who have followed me for a while... I opened this up tremendously. So it was always so tight in here. It was a very tough environment to work in. And, um, you know, now you can breathe a little bit. And it's a, the ability to expand upon these two particular sections and showcase my better material for the collector. Um, you know, and also, though, for people to get that, that, that first grabs, potentially, on new material coming in to provide that in this shop for my, for my customer base. So... I'm very proud of this shop. I'm very happy with how it's turned out. It's been a tremendous amount of work. Let's take you over to the Red Building. We're going to just walk right down the street. It's a Red Building. Check this bad boy out. Good books bought and sold. My mom made that sign. Look at the hanging pots. Love the porch out here. I'll show you where we hung that big sign. Right up there. I'll put a light on it. And I'll bring you in here. I have a table and chairs to go out here. Mom did the book curtains. You can check them out. <laughs> They're pretty cool. So, all right, let's take you in. All right, welcome all. Here we go. Now, it's still a little cluttered up, but um, I still have some work to do in here tonight and tomorrow. But let's take you on the tour. So, here's the prices right there. Find it, find better deals. I don't think you can. I've been selecting out and I have things labeled now and I'll just show you kind of the quality of content. Um, beautiful books, beautiful books here. So I added another double-sided shelf. It's kind of international, global, it goes back. Uh, this cute little table and chairs will be up front and uh, I moved this in. 
Great display for the large coffee table books. I got more art to hang. And I have such an overflow here, but just giving you an idea. And I'll be probably most likely starting on whatnot. I'm going to try to build up to about 500 people watching that get on to my whatnot. And I'll promote that in the future. And then I'll probably start auctioning off sections and stuff like that because I have such tremendous flow that I can't even keep up with. So here's the literature, both sides, same with this side, and boxes of it all over. Look at the stacks of paperbacks here. Tons of stuff, beautiful art books, art, acting, movies, cookbooks. This is a children's section right here. It goes into here. Um, I think this is juvenile stuff. You walk to the back. Everything with a dot on the spine is two bucks. That's a lot of popular fiction to the back. Vintage stuff. Look at this. So I'll be actually back here tonight too. Just getting this prepped. It's unsorted back here because I started, well, I told people, I started losing my mind. <laughs> so, anyhow, that is this building. I love it when the shades are wide open. The light coming in here is immaculate. Immaculate. So, I'm very happy with this. And this is the start, I think, of really, really great things here. I hope you enjoyed my tour. You know, in this building itself, I had boxes this whole way stacked up to here. I've I've removed thousands and thousands of pounds of books from from here to try to select the very best stuff uh, for my for my customer base and what I think they would be interested in. And I have um I've I've opened up the space. It might not <laughs> look like it. But the day of, I had to put this video out and make this as soon as I could because I'm not going to be able to next two days. So, um, but I'm very happy with this space. I mean, if you follow my journey, you know, this long on my YouTube channel, you've you've seen the growth taking place. You've seen the reformations of the shops, and it's uh, it's 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 fantastic. It's fantastic. It's you're kind of seeing a, a dream being lived out and expanded upon. Even this town itself, Smithville, is starting to clean up and look a lot nicer and people are becoming motivated to to do some things around here it's very encouraging and, and i'm always i'm always preaching that smithville is the type of town where we don't have to deal with excessive red tape and bureaucracy so we can kind of operate um you know on on i think a more comfortable level to certain to certain extents i mean there's always your your issues and whatnot with other things which we won't get into the muck of but this is kind of a town where you can almost it's like build a bear you could build your own town so i'm trying to do what i can and provide a, a, a beautiful books for for a wonderful uh price and encourage a little bit more community activity this year and the goal is to get more in-shop sales and we've marketed um through radio, social media, newspapers, you name it. So these giveaways in the shop will give me a good idea as to how what marketing was most effective. And um, I'm going to share that with you guys and, and go over it for those who are uh, trying to start their own bookstores and at least what was working for me and my little nook in the world. So guys, if you haven't signed up for the giveaways, go ahead. Um, it's only eight questions and it helped me better the YouTube channel. And then I'll be doing a live drawing on Monday at 8 o'clock. That's June 3rd, Monday at 8 o'clock. And I'll tell you how the day went and everything. Anyhow, I'm going to close out this video. Thank you so much for all your love and support out there. And again, it, it means everything to me. And I'll try to do more different types of giveaways and different things to just try to connect better with you guys. And, um, you know, I want to give back. Every time you like, share, and comment, it, it means a lot to me, so and it helps out my channel. So thank you very much. Almost at 5,000. Maybe we'll have a party then. All right, guys. That's it for me. I got to get back to work. I can't chat with you all day. I'm a motor mouth. I, I chirp all day. All right, we'll see you. Have a good day. Uh, until Monday, June 3rd, I'll see you then.